Find the equation of the hyperbola with the given vertices and asymptotes. Let's go ahead and do it. We'll start by drawing a picture. So here is the y-axis and here is the x-axis. So x and y. Let's go ahead and plot the vertices. So here is one vertex, so negative 6. And here is the other vertex, so 6. The hyperbola passes through the vertices, so this will open right and left. So we have a hyperbola that opens left and right. The center is right in the middle, so in this case the center is 0, 0. The distance from the center to one of the vertices is a, so in this case a is equal to 6, so a is 6. Now the formula for the asymptotes of a hyperbola that opens left and right is y equals plus or minus b over a times x minus h plus k, where h comma k is the center of the hyperbola. But in this case, the center is 0, 0, as we've already seen over here. So h is 0 and k is 0. So we just end up with y equals plus or minus b over a times x. So let's use this one. What we'll do is we'll set the slope of 4 thirds equal to b over a. So b over a is equal to 4 over 3. We know one of these variables. We know what a is. So let's go ahead and plug it in. So we get b over 6 equals 4 over 3. Cross multiply. So we get 3b equals 24. And then divide by 3. And that gives us b equals 8. So we have a, we have b, and so now we can write down the equation of the hyperbola, and we're done. So for a hyperbola that opens left and right, the general formula is x minus h quantity squared over a squared minus y minus k quantity squared over b squared, and this is equal to 1. In this problem, the center is 0, 0, so both h and k are 0. So we end up with x squared over a squared. Well, a was 6, so 6 squared is 36. 36 minus y squared, because k is 0, and then b was 8. So b squared is 8 squared, which is 64. So over 64, and this is equal to 1. And that is the final answer. I hope this helps.